Hello everyone, first video for this channel, uh, definitely not the last since I have a couple more lined up at least, but uh, where I live in it's pretty hard to find old sealed CCG products and stuff like that, so yeah, as, as I find more I will definitely open them here and upload the videos and, to this channel, so starting off with this, so okay, first of all, uh, full disclosure, English is not my first language. Um, that would be Spanish, since I'm from Chile. So I apologize in advance for any mistakes that I will probably make. Um, but yeah, um, so basically I got 19 Harry Potter base set booster packs uh, that I will be opening now. Um, most of them are actually in Spanish, uh, as you can see here. Uh, some of them in English, but, you know, um, I will open them in really no, no order, just, just want to see what I can, what I can pull. Uh, this game, tons of memories for this game, uh, definitely a huge nostalgia factor for me. Uh, I was around six or seven years old when this game came out, it's been... 20 years since uh, I've held sealed Harry Potter booster packs, so definitely excited for this. Um, so yeah, um, let's get right to it. Uh, in terms of lottery cards and good pulls and stuff like that, mostly, if, if you know about Harry Potter TCG, it's mostly going to be, for the base sets, it's going to be mostly the Unicorn and Professor Snape. Those are the two cards that are definitely the most saw, the most sought after. And the ones that uh, basically give the booster packs their, their price. Uh, really, there's no other really expensive cards, but, you know... Still, opening these to me is definitely a treat, so let's see, let's see what we get. So, again, no particular order, I think, uh, yeah, these are, these are the English packs, these are the Spanish packs, I don't really care much about the, the language, but uh, I care mostly about the cards, so let's get right to it and open. So, this actually first time I open booster packs in camera, so looking at the camera while doing it, definitely not not the best, um, so I'll be doing it like this, okay. So first pack here, so I don't know, I, I I'll just sift through the comments, there's no really, no real reason to, to check them out too much uh, so these are how the Spanish cards look uh, so yeah let's get to it and see what our first rare card is I already saw it was a Charmus card so Incendio okay I'll leave the rares there and keep opening actually don't have too much memory left, so I will do it, I won't take too much time to do this, so, commons, 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 and the rare for this, transfiguration test, again, pretty standard, nothing, nothing too amazing so far, okay, let's keep going, don't want to run out of time. There we go. So going through the comments pretty quick. See what we can see what we can find. Mountain troll. Okay. Let's open now. Uh, how about an English pack? Membral there, fall through, etc. etc. 
Rare is another Incendio, okay. Let's keep going. My intention was not to ruin the packs, but um, yeah, it's pretty hard to keep them keep them whole. Rare is Delivery Owl. Okay, let's keep going. I'm a huge fan of other uh, booster opening channels, so this is sort of like a mini dream come true to do this. Uh, and okay, we actually managed to keep and not destroy one of the packs. Regardably, Viosa, uh, Potions Mistake, blah, blah, blah. Potions Exam, and our rare Phoenix Feather Wand. Okay. Should probably clean up my workspace here. Yeah, pretty, pretty messy in the first few minutes. I'm sorry. Okay, next pack. Potions mistake. Curious Raven, Steel Claw, Remember All, the Fall Brew, etc., etc., etc. And the rare is a uh, Raven to Writing Desk. I think this card is called. Let's keep going. Yeah, pretty tough to open booster packs, more than I remember. Okay. And the rare potion ingredients. Let's go with an English booster pack. Okay, that was much easier. Squiggle Quill, Pet Rat, Boil Cure, Expoximize, and a rare is another Delivery Owl. Lots of duplicates, strangely enough. But as I said, just Opening these is a is a you know trip down memory memory lane as some people say. So a pleasure to do this. Some of the names are pretty liberal translations, as uh, you can probably see if you speak Spanish. So some of them I don't really understand, but okay, okay. Would you look at that? We actually pulled the Snape. Wow. Okay. Um, that's already <laughs> that already pays for for the packs right away. So, and it's a uh, Spanish Snape. So that's pretty cool. Okay. Very good to see. Hospital Wing, Bobulus, Pure Cauldron, Wing Army Leviosa. Pet Toad, Diagonally, Transfiguration, and a rare History of Magic. I'm as excited as uh, the trio there in the in the art. <laughs> um, but let's keep going. These were kept in some apparently some basement or something, so they were pretty bent, the, the, the part, uh, you know, the, the flap there on top and bottom, pretty bent, kind of hard to open. Abbey Force, the Scottish Stag, uh, Wick, no, oh, I forgot the name of this card in English anyway. Uh, Lost Notes, Curious Raven, Accio was translated as Magic Word, 
I don't know why. I don't know why. Pet Toad. Queen Keys. Potions Transfiguration are rare is another history of magic. Yeah. Yeah, not not the best, but uh Hey, we already pulled the Snape, so that's already amazing. Let's keep going. Okay, let's keep going. Sorry for the phone if you can hear it. Pewter Cauldron, Wingardium Leviosa, Vermilius, Erumpin Potion, Dung Bomb, Toe Batter, etc., etc., etc. Potions, transfer, uh, Transfiguration, and our rare is. Holy shit. Okay. I'm sorry for the swearing. Um, okay, I'm really sorry. And wish the camera sort of picked it up better. Pack Fresh Spanish Unicorn. That is pretty amazing. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. So we already pulled uh, pretty much the two cards that I most wanted to pull. So... That's really, really fantastic. Okay, I don't want to block the camera with my hand here. Okay. It's actually my first time doing this, uh, recording. Uh, I bought this tripod specifically for this, so this is my first time recording booster opening. There we go. Commons, commons. Nothing too exciting. Kelpie. Charms and Gringotts Cart Ride. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Again, not not a money card or anything like that, but it's a holo, so that's pretty cool. So we're almost done with the Spanish booster packs. Not that I s decided to save the English booster packs for last, but um, just were the ones near. Let's go. Okay. Dung Bomb, Toe Biter, Squiggle Quill, Incarcy Force, the Surly Hound, Forest Troll, Nurture, Dragonheart 1, um, Transfiguration, Curve Magical Creatures, and a Rare. Okay, yeah. I, at this point, <laughs> I don't mind this. If, um, if we hadn't pulled either Snape or the Unicorn or neither of them, I would be, yeah, much... Uh, more disappointed, but yeah, it's actually history of magic. I, I've looked at many other uh, base set booster openings and um, history of magic, transfiguration, test, and stuff like that. Stuff that just comes up very often. Um, whereas something like the unicorn, I think it's, people were saying something like one every five boxes or something like that. So for being just 19 loose booster packs pulling both a Snape and a Unicorn. It's pretty damn fortunate, so let's keep going. Mysterious Egg, Diagon Alley, Transfiguration, I see another holo here. Professor Phileas Flitwick, another rather expensive card, and actually one that I didn't have. Actually, both Snape and Flitwick were both missing from my collection, so yeah, this is excellent, absolutely excellent. Um, only three packs left. Uh, this went by much quicker than I expected, so let's go. Last three packs. We already pulled everything I pretty much wanted to pull, so at this point it's just rest of the rares and stuff is just gravy. Squiggle Quill, Pen Rat, Rampant Potion, Lost Notes, Bobulus, Hagrid and the Stranger, Quick Wing Keys, Ollivanders, Scare Magical Creatures, uh, Charms and our rare Titolando. Okay. Okay. Not a, not a bad little rare there. So, two packs left. And 
let's see what we get. The camera would just focus, okay. Sorry if there were other focus uh, issues here. Uh, but okay, let's do this. Take tarantula, dragon heart wand, apparate, potions, transpiration, and platform nine three quarters. Another uh, sort of common rare card that you see you see a lot in, in, in these openings. We just got one here. Unless obviously the last one is that very same card, which I doubt. So for our last booster here, let's see. Okay, Black Constrictor, Cars Force, Restricted Section, Scottish Stag. I think the card was Vicious Wolf. Yeah, that was the name, Vicious Wolf. There we go, <laughs> Vicious Wolf, yeah. Uh, Reptile House, Apothecary. Magical creatures, creatures, uh, charms, and our last rare, uh, possibly ever, as I don't think I will ever find sealed uh, booster packs for the base set in Harry Potter in Chile. So let's see. Draco Malfoy, okay, another foil, okay. That's pretty cool. Okay, so let's go over the rares real quick here. Uh, so, I put them in, in order here, so... So here are the rares we pulled. Incendio, uh, Transfiguration Test, Mount Troll, another Incendio, Delivery Owl, uh, Phoenix Feather Wand, Raven to Writing Desk, Potion Ingredients, Another Delivery Owl, History of Magic, History of Magic, I don't know if we pull them back to back, but anyways, our Unicorn, pretty amazing, Gringotts card right, pretty cool, History of Magic, wow, we pulled three, I don't remember pulling three, okay, Snape, that's pretty amazing, look at that. Professor Phyllis Flitwick, another pretty cool card. All the the uh, teacher cards that uh, provided one one of the um, lesson types are pretty good. So definitely glad to to pull this. Tirlando, platform nine three quarters, and Draco Malfoy. So yeah, actually pretty good pulls. I didn't expect uh, to pull. So I guess there's also Dean Thomas and Hannah Abbott or also cards that are pretty expensive. But um, I, I actually do prefer the uh, lesson granting professors here. So definitely along with the unicorn, uh, the highlights of this video. So yeah, pretty happy with this. Pretty, pretty happy with this. So yeah. Um, this was the first video in this new channel. Um, have a couple more uh, from Lord of the Rings TCG, the one uh, by Decipher. Um, as you can probably see, or maybe not, uh, but this playmat here is from the Lord of the Rings LCG. I'm a huge fan of LCGs, particularly the cooperative ones. So Arkham Horror and Lord of the Rings mostly um, are pretty much my favorite games right now. Um, but obviously LCGs don't have the uh, random aspect that TCGs have and the excitement of opening them. Um, so yeah, okay, that's it for now. I'm pretty happy with this and see you in the next one.